Guy at Red Dog Music again. Uh, we've got a very exciting little toy coming to the shop today. The Korg Monotron Delay. Hold on a minute there, sir. Before you get too carried away, we're just going to give you a quick run through of what it actually has, feature wise, and then we're going to let Mr. Jenk here, our service oh. expert, but also electronic music extraordinaire, guide you through. It's not working. Let's turn the volume down, you oh. boner. <laughs> so you got the on-off switch here, which you can select which LFO you want. So let's use a triangle. So you got your rate, your LFO amount, your filter, and your um, delay settings. And so you got a basic synth, just uh, same as the original monotone, but with a delay surprising is the delay output goes back into, into the machine through the, fil um, through the filter. So you can hear now. <laughs> so you can get these really weird, I don't know, sounds. Dirty. Dirty. And the unit itself is noisy as well. You can hear it. Which is interesting because you can like make that feedback more and it just builds up into this weird noise. It's, it's quite a quirky, noisy type of device, which is really cool, I think. When there's no signal at all, nothing playing, yeah. it's still making that noise, yeah. which you will be able to hear maybe on the video. Well, there you go. Which is a noticeable thing if you were playing a gig or something, that would be on the verge of annoying. Unless you had music blazing, you know, then you'd probably be okay. And uh, so that's, this is the basic sound, and you've got the other four, it's always assigned to pitch, you can't change it to anything else. So you can switch it to the square, and obviously this combined with the delay function. Also, in addition to these, it's got a weird screw here that you can change the LFO shape. You can make it invert or, you know, change the square shape as well. Cool. And that's what all it does. And it's also got an auxiliary input, so you can feed any kind of audio source, which we've done the, uh, the monotribe here. So you can hear the beats playing through now. So I can use the delay or, or the filter or also use the synthesis at the same time. But the delay is pretty cool actually. So if you have annoying neighbours, yeah, you can burn them. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. It's also definitely worth mentioning that this has a tiny little speaker, just like the Monotron did. Ooh, look at that beautiful thing. Which means you'll be able to hear from this microphone here. Sounds pocket sized 35 pounds. Buy one. <laughs> Oh, 
That was weird. 